This is DRM News, bringing you an urgent and heartbreaking update from Gaza's Nisirat camp, where a dire humanitarian crisis is unfolding. On Sunday, July 20th, 2025, massive crowds of displaced Palestinians packed into a cramped compound in the heart of the Gaza Strip, clutching bowls and buckets, hoping for just a few ladles of soup to ease their gnawing hunger. As health officials sound the alarm on a spiralling hunger crisis, the scenes of desperation paint a grim picture of survival in a war-torn region. We don't want meat, chicken or poultry, just flour and bread to eat and hopefully stave off hunger, cried Umm Mahmoud Abu Tarbush, a Palestinian mother whose plea echoes the anguish of millions. She, like countless others, is begging for Gaza's borders to open, allowing a flood of life-saving aid to reach those on the brink. The United Nations issued a stark warning today declaring that civilians in Gaza are starving and in desperate need of an immediate influx of food and medical supplies. The Gaza Health Ministry reports a devastating toll. At least 71 children have succumbed to malnutrition since the war began, with 60,000 more suffering from its crippling symptoms. In a chilling update, the ministry confirmed that 18 people died of hunger in the past 24 hours alone, underscoring the urgency of the crisis. Residents say finding basic essentials like flour has become nearly impossible, with food prices soaring far beyond what most of Gaza's population of over 2 million can afford. The United Nations Relief and Works Agency, UNRWA, is sounding the alarm, demanding that Israel allow more aid trucks to cross into Gaza. According to UNRWA, Enough food to sustain the entire population for three months is ready and waiting, but it's being held up at the borders. Israel, however, has pushed back against accusations of blocking aid, pointing the finger at alleged theft by Hamas, a claim the group vehemently denies. Israel further argues that the United Nations has failed to collect aid already prepared for transport into Gaza, leaving critical supplies stranded. As the blame game continues, the people of Gaza are paying the ultimate price. The images from Nasserat camp are a stark reminder of the human cost of this crisis. Families huddled together, children weakened by hunger, and a community clinging to hope for relief. DRM News will continue to follow this developing story, bringing you the latest updates and diving deep into the global response to this unfolding tragedy. What will it take to end this suffering? Stay with us as we explore the crisis and its far-reaching implications.